Hi friends, welcome to Doodle Buddies with Nosh. So as the thumbnail says, um, we are going to make uh, bottle cap pumpkins today. The first step is that I've painted all these bottle caps. I've used acrylic paint to paint them. Painted orange because obviously we're making pumpkins. The next step is that I'm going to uh, use the hot glue gun and uh, make holes in these um, bottle caps preferably in the center, like so. Make it slightly uh, larger. You can also use a sharp knife or um, a pin to uh, drive through that um, hole, like so. Now once all the uh, bottle caps have got these holes done, we're going to use a piece of yarn um, because we can't obviously put a needle through it. So we are, what we're going to do is uh, put some, put a little bit of masking tape at the um, at the at one end and drive that through the um, through the bottle caps, like so here. And I think we could. Um, what I've done is I've kept uh, almost 14 to 15 bottle caps for one pumpkin. Now you can tie it up with, a, with two knots, like so. Now once you've once you've uh, tied it up, you can just wiggle the, uh, the caps a little bit so as to form a circle. Now that the frame is ready, I'm going to give it a base. This is just a, an ordinary cardboard, thin cardboard. I'm just going to cut it round and uh, glue it underneath the, the, um, the pumpkin. Now that the bottle caps um, have adhered to the uh, to the base, I'm going to use this little twig. I uh, yeah, I've just uh, glued it or glued it, and I'm going to make it stand and hold it for some time so that it uh, it strengthens. Yep. Next, I'm going to uh, cut tiny leaf shapes from uh, the green plastic bottle, the Seven Up bottle. And I'll use a little bit of um, hot glue to adhere it to the uh, to the stems of the pumpkins. And with that, that's it. Actually, I wanted to distress it as well uh, with a little bit of the uh, Dimholz Ranger uh, distress ink, but I decided against it because it looked just perfect the way it was. I didn't want to distress it. So yeah, that's just about it. I've made three more. They look absolutely adorable. <laughs> very cute and uh, it's something that you can try with your children of course you can do the, um, the 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 part where you have to make holes you can do it yourself the rest of it the kids can do and they'd love this activity as well so um, that's that 
how do you think it looks? It looks beautiful, doesn't it? So um, I'd love it if you could subscribe to my uh, channel and uh, like and share as well. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye now. Love it if you Thank you.